Hi love bugs! So today I am going to do a, another pet peeve video for you except this time it is going to be my YouTube pet peeves. Um, everything that I listed last time in my pet peeves video was like stuff in the real world that you have to deal with basically on a daily basis so um, without further ado let me get right into it. Number one. When people say, I'll link that down below. I'll link that down below. And when I'm doing this, and I'll link that down below. Um, first off, advertising for yourself like that over and over is fucking annoying. So stop. Like, if you want to tell people that there's going to be things down below for them to look at, and when you get to the end of your video, just be like, and everything I mentioned in this video will be listed down below. Okay, I found one YouTuber so far that literally I counted 19 times in one video that was six minutes long. She said after like everything she said, she was like, and I'll link that down below. I unsubscribed because I couldn't handle it. I was like, I originally subscribed because she did like a, a review on some lip, lipsticks and lip glosses and she was really pretty and you know, whatever. So I was like, I'm going to subscribe to her. And then after watching like maybe 10 of her videos and hearing her say, I'll link that down below so many times in every single video, unsubscribe. I'm sorry. I just couldn't handle that. That was too freaking annoying. Number two, yay. When people say, as you can tell by the title of my video, I'm gonna do a insert title here video for you guys. Duh, bitch. Of course we can tell by the title of your video. That's why you're supposed to put a title there. Don't like freaking, like just say what the video is about. Like every other YouTuber, hey guys, this video is going to be a freaking haul for you today. Hey guys, this video is going to be about, you know, my ass, you know, whatever. Just, just say what it's going to be about. There's no reason to tell us that by the title of your video, we know what video you're going to make, but here's the video you're going to make. Like, stop. That's annoying too. All right. Number three. I had to write all this down so I didn't forget. Um, I'm also going to post it all on my Tumblr so that you guys can see um, all the stuff that I was talking about. And I might possibly add more that I didn't have in this video because I don't want this video to be too long. Number three, when people talk for 10 minutes before actually getting to the point of the video that they're making, um, don't title it like lipstick review and then take 10 minutes to tell us that you decided that you needed to shower and then curl your fucking hair, brush your teeth, take a piss, eat breakfast, wash your car, clip your toenails. Yeah, you get my point? We don't need to know all that shit. If the video is going to be about one thing, then get to the fucking point. I don't want to sit through 10 minutes of your video about what you had to do when you woke up in the morning because it's really annoying too. So, um, for those of you that make videos that way, um, two minutes tops if you want to talk about your life. That's kind of how I look at it. I try not to go over one minute if I want to talk about my life before I get into a good video. But, really, come on, any longer than that, I'm going to stop watching and I'm not going to even pay any attention because... If, if I do, like, if it's a video I really want to see and somebody's talking about their freaking life for the first 10 minutes, I'm going to, like, click all the way past the talking and then go to the part where I really wanted to see. Um, I won't subscribe to you, though. Number four. I hope you guys like these videos where I'm bitching about shit. Um, when people have their kids in their videos, okay? I'm sorry, but I don't like kids. And I never have. I never will. This is my personal outlook on life. Um, most people love kids. I don't. I can't stand kids personally. And for everybody that's been around for a while, you all know this. So this is nothing new. No, I'm never having children either. So um, I'm going to live my life riding my motorcycle um, with my significant other and I'm going to enjoy life and I'm going to be selfish and buy myself all kinds of stuff. Um, 
So yeah, um, kids and videos. Let's let's get into this this right here, okay? If you're gonna make a video and title it, you know, we'll just say lipstick review again. If your fucking kid's gonna be in the background banging shit around and yelling and screaming, and you're turning around going, "Oh, Gucci, Gucci, Goo, oh my little baby," okay, put that in your fucking title, please, because I don't want to waste my time trying to watch a fucking video about something that I'm trying to like you know, I want to know about, and then your little brat is in the video with you. And last I checked, I'm pretty sure there's actually, like, some guidelines on YouTube that, um, state something about having children in the videos. Um, but I'm, I'm not 100% sure on that, so I would have to actually go back and read it, and this could have been a while ago when I first started YouTube, but now it's like... I don't know, it's probably not even there anymore because kids are, like, making porn now. So, whatever. But, yeah, so put up a warning sign saying that your damn babies or your damn annoying kids are going to be in your videos because that way um, it will let the rest of us move along and not subscribe to you. Um, it's just annoying to have your kids in there and interrupting and distracting and, like, I don't find it cute. Some people find it cute. Some people think, you know, it's cute that your kid's in the video, blah, blah, blah. But when they're, like, they're just being annoying, it's totally not cute to me. It's never cute anyway because I don't like kids. Number five. People who can't sing, okay? I know that I can't sing, okay? I lie. I can't sing very well, but... The people that, like, get on YouTube and they think they can sing and... They keep singing and singing over and over and over and making new videos. And you still suck. Didn't you, like, see that you got, like, two million hits on, like, this terrible video that you sung in? And you got one million dislikes? Doesn't that say something to you? For real. Like, I would fucking go under the covers and hide for the rest of my life if that happened to me. Yes, there is somebody on YouTube that is an absolute horrible singer. She's about 400 pounds at least. And she looks like she doesn't have any teeth. And um, she's really disgusting. Very repulsive looking and sounding and everything. She's just completely repulsive. So, um, yeah, she's got like a couple mil hits on one of her videos and then it's got like a couple million dislikes. Girl, stop. It's gross. I don't watch videos like that. I watched maybe for like the first 30 seconds to see what the hell this was all about because people were talking about it and I was just like, whoa, disgusting. I couldn't even watch. Like, and there is no such thing as you go, girl, you get out there and do your thing. She sucks. She's not good at it. She's not doing anything good in the video. So for those of you who think she, you know, was brave and put herself out there, good for you because I don't think she was brave. I think she was just fucking stupid and looking for attention. Number six, 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 six. People who play with their fucking hair. Really? Okay, let's, here, here. Let's pretend this is my hair, okay? Hi guys, today I'm gonna do a video for you and it's gonna be about how I just play with my fucking hair in my whole 20 minute long video and I'm just gonna keep just keep doing it because it's not moving or going anywhere but I just don't know why I just can't stop touching it. Stop! This is like my number one pet fucking peeve of YouTube users. Why do you all touch your hair so much? I will say I am somewhat guilty of doing this because if I'm doing a haul or something, like I sit, if you guys don't know, I'm on my couch. Like this is my couch, one of my couches. I have three couches in my living room because I have a big living room. But this is my couch. I am sitting Indian style the whole time here. So when I do my hauls, I have my bags here and I look down and then my hair is like all over. So then I do like I'll readjust it. Or if it's wet when I'm recording a video, I'll like try to puff it up to try to make it look cuter because it just looks horrific to me. Anyway, stop playing with your hair. There's no fucking reason for it. Just stop. And not to mention your nasty ass extensions. Like 
you girls are putting extensions in your hair and they look terrible. Either the color doesn't match or your haircut is wrong or you just didn't put them in right and they don't look good. I used to wear extensions but now my hair is long enough to where I don't feel like I need them and um, I don't care about volume. I don't have any volume in my hair. It's straight and flat so I don't care. Stop playing with your hair. It's fucking annoying. I have stopped watching YouTube videos because some girl is playing with her hair too much in there and it's distracting. Your hands are just constantly stroking around your freaking face. Stop. Please. Please. You guys can do all the other shit that I don't like. Just stop playing with your fucking hair. <laughs> um, so, anyway, if you can play with your hair for 20 minutes in your 20 minute video, you got some serious issues. Maybe you should like go get like something to put in your hands while you're doing a video. Um, keep something in your hands. Like, I don't know, maybe pretend you're talking into a microphone. Something. Maybe, maybe you can sing really shitty and play with your hair at the same time and like, yeah, fuck. I hate when people play with their hair in fucking videos. Anyway, that is all of the YouTube pet peeves that I have for you guys right now. I'm sure there are many, many others, but these are just the ones that really irritate the fuck out of me. So I am actually going to make this a tag video, and I take all of you guys to make um, a YouTube pet peeves video on what bothers you about other YouTubers or yourself. I am guilty of probably every single one of these, but I don't keep going on about them. Like, I mean, I don't do them every single time in every one of my videos. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please click like, and I will try to um, think of some more ideas um, on like stupid stuff like this. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.